J.K. Rowling, the writer of the Harry Potter series of books, showed us how you can actually lead through imagination, how you can be inspired through imagination. Please watch this video until the end so that you will also learn what we can learn from J.K. Rowling. Hey, my name is Armin L. Rao. I'm the founder of A. Leonard Rao, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur. And I'm glad to have you here to, in order to help you to become a great leader. I've been a leader, coach, and entrepreneur for more than 20 years. And I'm sharing my experience these days with young entrepreneurs who are now in a position to change into managers and leaders. This video is actually about J.K. Rowling, the author of the Harry Potter books, and what we can learn from her in terms of leadership. Now, there are actually three success secrets of J.K. Rowling that I learned when, you know, watching interviews with her, watching her speak. She did quite a nice commencement speech, I think at Harvard too. And number one of the success secrets is be humble. If you look at her, J.K. Rowling, she's so humble, she's so modest, she will never forget where she comes from because she comes from a very, very modest environment. And even in the times of success, she still is, how can I say, the humble girl that she has always been uh, from the very beginning. So first thing that we can learn as a leader from JK Rowling is be humble, be grateful, never forget where you're coming from and show this to the external world. That will give you a lot of sympathy and that will also make people follow you. Success secret number two that JK Rowling from my point of view applied which is never give up. Now if you think back uh, in, to the early days of the creation of the Harry Potter books the first one uh, she started actually writing it in a cafe in Edinburgh in 1997 because you know probably her uh, humble living circumstances in a little flat in Edinburgh were not too inspiring so she went to this cafe she also told that you know the owners knew her very well and always made sure that she could have the same table in the corner where she could also look outside and daydream maybe a little bit to get further in her writing and she never gave up she just was in this cafe she did not have an office she did not have a fancy desk she did not have an editor she, did, she had nothing and she believed in her idea she believed in her idea. She was just so convinced. So if you have something that you're convinced of, that you believe in, where you believe I can actually fulfill my mission and make the world a better place, stick with it and never give up. That's success secret number two from JK Rowling. Leadership secret number three for entrepreneurs from the JK Rowling side is imagine the future. So if you think about it, it is quite amazing that J.K. Rowling already in the early days of conceiving the plot and the contents for her Harry Potter books, she had all the characters in mind. She had a very, very clear imagination about how the whole story would develop. And she knew the roles and responsibilities of everybody in that story. So think about your organization. Can you imagine the future? Imagine the future. Who's doing what in the future? Who's taking which role in three years, in five years? And take this as a guiding principle and as a motivation to build your business into the future. That's what you can also learn from J.K. Rowling. Now, as a conclusion, I'd like to say <clears throat> the humility the never give up attitude and imagining the future are three entrepreneurial traits that we can actually adopt from somebody like J.K. Rowling and maybe also from her main character, Harry Potter, who did not give up either, who could imagine things and who also had a very, very down-to-earth nature. Did you actually read the Harry Potter books? So if you did, um, please leave a comment underneath this video and share with the community what you learned from the Harry Potter books in terms of leadership. Now, humble, uh, being humble, um, imagining the future and never giving up are three important traits of 
entrepreneurs. The LIFE program actually teaches you the most important skills and competencies of entrepreneurs for leadership and management worldwide. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and join the community, subscribe, uh, um, put on the bell underneath this video and at the end of the day I would be really happy to have you again. Don't forget, lead yourself.